out of here. This is a historic event we in right now. Peace and love to everybody in the sound of my voice right now. Taking the blessing right now. I only got about 10 minutes. So I didn't want to just run through classic, classic, classic. Let me show you the art of an MC. We gotta go off the road. Take me off the road and let me talk to the people. Come to the craft. Come to remind yourself. Let's talk about why is that you must learn. Let's give it to them. Now what we gonna do is open the class. I know you might hear for something else. You might have came for something else, but I'm gonna recalibrate you since it's the 50th year of hip hop. Yeah. First thing you gotta understand, Kitty Qua. A real MC is all about that freestyle. My man got the camera up. What he's getting is a legend with his stamina up. I'm showing you the real skill. This is how we used to do it. This is how we build. My shit is all insane. I go off the top like JFK's brain. Fuck with it. This is KR. Spitting shit out like that. Hey, listen. You don't know about me. I'm the original BDP from 1983. Let's get it rocking. All day, every day. This is hip hopping. Now let's get metaphysical. Turn that down. I'm about to spit that lyrical. This the class. Me? I'm called the blast. Turn it up a little bit more. That's right, right there. That's about level four. Now listen to me, raw MC, taking you back to what it's supposed to be. This is that metaphysical rhyme. Keep your camera up. I'm about to expand your mind. Right now there's two of me. One you can see, that's the physical me. But then there's another me. That's the future me that's happening at 3. At 3 a.m. tonight, I'm sitting in my hotel. I'm feeling right. I'm sitting on my hotel in a bed, and I'm visualizing this whole moment in my head. That means the 3 o'clock me is watching me right now, MC. You got to see with your mental health. You ain't got nobody but your future self. Be a friend to your future self. This is all about health and mental wealth. See, there's two of me. This is the present me. There's a future me. The future me, like I said, is sitting on his bed, seeing this whole moment in his head. So you got to ask you and me, is it me spitting live with him giving me my poetry? Me, I'm in the spirit. You can't see me, but the other me, you can hear it. Because if you really are a friend, you can go inside your mind and come back here again. Three o'clock, when you look at your wrist. Three o'clock tonight, come back here with Chris. I'm telling you, this shit is really gnarly. <laughs> this is called the after party. Turn up. friend to your future self you ain't got no one else you better listen to me so now i open up your mind off the top with the rhyme me i'm called the teacher i open up your mind yeah, let me take it all the way back and you know if you can hear me in the back somebody said Genesis chapter 11 verse 10 explains the genealogy of Shem. Shem was a black man in Africa. If you repeat this fact, they can't. Genesis 14 verse 13. Abraham steps on the scene. Being a descendant of Shem, which is a fact, means Abraham too was 
Abraham, born in the city of a black man, called Nimrod, grandson of Ham. Ham had four sons, one was named Canaan. Here, let me do some explaining. Abraham was the father of, Isaac was the father of, Jacob had 12 sons, for real, and these were the children of Israel. According to Genesis chapter 10, the Egyptians descended from Ham. 1600 years, my brothers, you've got to read up. Well, Moses was born in Egypt. In this era, black Egyptians, they weren't right. They enslaved black Cushites. Moses had to be of the black race because he spent 40 years in Pharaoh's place. He passed as the Pharaoh's grandson. So he had to look just Lest my brothers and sisters take this here song, go correct the wrong. The information we get today is just what? But ask yourself. Bullets! Let me talk to my craft writers.